Alrighty. Um, somebody mentioned this, so I'm going to make a video of it. But the question was, how much force to get a large print off of the print bed? I'm going to let it cool down a, a little bit more, it's down to like 30 degrees. Um, this is faceless, 400 millimeters tall. As you can see, it is almost the full width of the print bed. Remember, this bed is not all printable. It's printable to about here. They oversize the plate, and the actual print bed comes out to about here. So this is taking over 50% of my printable area on a 300 by 300 millimeter print bed. And it is stuck down good. I don't see any warping. So we will let this cool down, and then I will record a clip of me removing it. Okay, it's cooled down. So now I'm going to try to remove faceless from the print bed. I have a little opening here. I hear it creaking. Well, it seems like it's coming off pretty easily, actually. The hardest part, as usual, would be getting that initial underneath the print. There we go. No problem. Came right off. Actually, it came off pretty damn easily, to be honest. That was that, that was actually pretty cool. I screwed up my bed level in the one corner, so I had to add a little glue to get the strands to stick for that one little piece there. That was my fault. I wasn't paying attention, but yeah, not bad. Nice smooth bottom. I love how you can see the infill. I love this transparent plastic. These lines here are the interior infill, but smooth on the outside. It's very nice. Very, very cool. That's actually a very cool print. So that's it. That's removing from the TiVo Tornado print bed. As you can see, no problem at all.